It's summertime in Jackson and that means it's barbecue season. We're here today at Hammond Hardware talking to Dave about your grill selection. Thanks yeah. for having us, Dave. Thanks for coming out. It's a beautiful summer day and yes, uh, 4th of July is behind us, but yes, we still got a lot of summer left to go and yes. a lot of grilling season. Um, we're going to go over some of the grills that we have available and some of the features and benefits that people can expect to get with some of these grills. Perfect. Um, we think we're the grill uh, superstore here in Jackson. We have a large selection of them and we keep them in stock. We have both LP and natural gas grills and that's something you don't get with most of the stores around here. We're going to take you a tour on the different grills and the different features about them. And we're going to start right here with the basic charcoal grill. It's been a staple of uh, grilling for literally 50 years. Um, it's called the Kettle Grill and it's made by Weber. It's charcoal, it's very inexpensive, anybody can get into a cheap grill with this. $150 will buy you like the best grill there is. So they come in various sizes, tabletop and, and up. You can do a lot of different things. You can have charcoal that has flavoring built right into it. You can do wood chunks, wood chips to get flavors and spices into your uh, grill and your meat. And so that's a good way to get a lot of different flavors into your meat and it's cheap and easy and anybody can do it. Next we move up to, these are the egg grills and a lot of people have seen them. They're real popular these days. They're, get, they're kind of on the pricey side. This would be like an upsell for grilling. This would be like, a, a, if you were an expert griller and you wanted to take it up a notch, this is the grill that you want. And this does a lot of different things. This will actually bake, sear, roast. You can cook pies and cookies and all kinds of crazy stuff. Pizzas are amazing in this. Wow. It, it uses a lump charcoal which actually runs hotter and lasts longer and can be restarted which most charcoal can't. So it lasts a long time. You can actually set this grill in the morning for like ribs or briskets and it'll hold the temperature you want for 12 hours. You come home from work and your food is done and ready to cook. It's, it's a little complicated for the average griller, but there's a lot of videos and things you can get online to help you use that if you want to get into something like that. If you've already mastered this and you want to move up, that's a great way to do it. Now, a, a new grill that we're seeing is called the pellet grill. And this is, this is uh, what I call the easy button. You just fill this little hopper full of pellets. You have a little dial here to set your temperature and you can go in and watch your football game or whatever and it just keeps the temperature for you. You have to do nothing. It's really good for smoking things like ribs, pork, briskets, roast. It's really good with that. It's not the best for like burgers and steaks. We consider this kind of like a complement to another grill. This is a good second grill to take to do things that you can't do with your regular grill. But they're really neat. They're, they're very well priced, actually. They're very fair priced. And then, of course, we have everybody's favorite is the gas grill. We have both LP and natural gas grills available. And when it comes to a gas grill, there's a lot of things you need to attend to and look at when you go to buy it. And we're going to go over some of those things. Um, not all grills are created equal. So what you want to do is you want to check some things. You want to check on the cook box. This area right through here, how well it's built and how it's constructed. This is what keeps your heat. So it's really important that you get a good one. And if you do a little shake test and like that, some grills you'll actually see them kind of wobble. And you don't want that. You want a good solid surface. And in a grill like this, there's a lifetime guarantee on the cook box. So you don't have to ever worry about it if you buy a really good one. If you buy a cheap one, you might have a problem with that. The burner system is the next thing that we worry about. And this is the heart of the grill. And they're not all created equal. Well, it's important to look at the burners of the grill that you purchase. A lot of them have some ports along here. That doesn't give you even heat distribution and the heat goes vertically rather than horizontally. Also, food can get inside there and they can plug the holes. That can be a problem. One like this has ports on both sides. This has double the ports of a standard grill that has only ports on this side. You get a more even heat distribution because mm -hmm. it's going off to the side. So between burners, you're getting a better, a better even heat throughout. There's no hot and cold spots on the grill. So if you have that problem where you got to move burgers, like it's too hot here and not hot enough here, a, a good grill and a good burner system will do that. The next thing we want to talk about is the grill grates. And the grates are what you cook with. There's two different styles that we like. This is cast iron, 
really good for searing. Now, the Broil King brand is what we recommend that we have, although we have other brands. They have a neat feature on their cast iron grates that also have this little uh, trough right here. And if you're cooking something with sauces on it, whether it be ribs, chicken, um, I like to put Italian dressing into my chicken and then the Italian dressing will just pour down and sit in here and it'll base the food. It does a really good job of infusing extra flavor into your meat. And then the other is stainless steel grates. This is the easy button. This is actually very easy to use and clean. You take some olive oil and you put it on there before you cook. It makes everything non-stick. Um, and then afterwards, you just can clean up with just a rag and some olive oil. You don't have to scrape, you don't have to grill. If you're tired of brushing your grill with uh, stainless steel brushes and worried about the, the fibers coming off, you don't have to worry about it with this. All you gotta do is either clean it with some olive oil. You can put it in the sink and clean it. Cast iron, you can't do that. You can't put soap and water in cast iron. So, outside of that, the important thing about these stainless steel grates is that they're truly stainless steel. You'll see a lot of stainless steel grates and that are called stainless steel, but they're not. True stainless is not magnetic. If you take a little magnet and you go shopping and you go like this, and it sticks like that, it's not true stainless steel. It should actually just fall like that. Um, a, a grill like this is a, got a lot of features. The side burner, which is famous, a lot of people like them, some people do not. <laughs> and then a rotisserie. The nice thing about our rotisseries on our grills, it has a burner back here. It's a 15,000 BTU burner. It actually creates a roasting effect for your rotisserie. So a lot of people tell me that when they try a rotisserie, the, the juices come down on the grill and it just starts flaming up and everything gets burnt. When you have that back burner and you're creating that convection effect, you don't have the, the flare ups, the heat, things like that going on. And one last thing about the Broil King grills. They're made in America. They're, they're, they're made in Huntington, Indiana, Dixon, Tennessee, and there is a plant in Waterloo, Ontario, but the closest you get to an import is Ontario, Canada. They are based in Ontario, Canada, so all your tech support, your warranty stuff is done right. Oh, well, that's like five, mi five hours from here. It's not very far. So we really like the fact that it's made with North American steel by North American workers and done, well, in Huntington, Indiana, most of our grills are built, and that's not very far from here, which is a nice feature with all the imports and all the problems we're seeing with it. We're seeing a lot of problems with things that came from China. We can't get them. This is not a problem with Boyle Cream Gills, and we have them in uh, LP and natural gas. We're the only place in town that has natural gas grills in stock. So if you have a natural gas uh, lead to your patio and want to get a grill, or you want to upgrade your existing natural gas grill, you need to come and see us. Yeah, you really are the experts. We, we try to be. Our staff is knowledgeable. Um, we will help you with parts. We have a huge, huge section of accessories. And even if you had warranty issues and you weren't getting the help you needed from the manufacturer, come see us. We'll make a phone call. We'll take care of it for you. Um, the Broil King grills, actually have a, a minimum of 10 year warranty and the new ones that we're getting in are 15 year warranties from stem to stern. So for 15 years, you don't have to worry about your grill. You may pay a little bit more for that, but it's definitely worth it in the end because you have that peace of mind that you got a, maybe your last grill for a lot right. of people. And we keep the parts and accessories in stock. So if you need to do something, you need to replace a burner, you need to fix a part, we've got it. Right. I think a lot of times when people are shopping for a grill, they have a lot of questions and having you as an expert and all of your staff knowing all the answers, that's super helpful. It is. And it's nice to have the inventory. We have uh, basically great support from our staff that do the buying and they make sure that we have the grill you need, the style you need, the fuel you need, whether it be uh, propane or natural gas. And of course, we have a filling station here for propane, so you, we're really your one-stop shop. We have the charcoal, we have the fuels, we have everything you need. And we, even if you have an existing grill and need parts and accessories for it, we have it. We're at Hammond Hardware, the corner of Francis and Prospect, now known as MLK and Prospect, so depending on which you remember it to be. But we've been here since 1956. We're still here, we're still going strong. We are your local grilling center, super center. Excellent. Like Dave said, there's lots of summer left. Stop in today and get your next grill.